Hey, man, what's going on? <laughs> Look, bro, you got to start knocking, man. You're always welcome here, but I at least need to know when you're in the building. You don't know what I'll be looking at on my computer. Hey, since you caught me here, man, have a seat. I want to show you my, my lap desk. Let me make some room for you real quick. Let's put that down there. Come on over here and sit down. All right, so I was using my son's 15-inch laptop, and uh, yeah, you can see that this thing fit here, fits here perfectly. It's got plenty of room for the laptop itself and a mouse. It doesn't have a dedicated mouse pad or anything like that, but uh, you got, I mean, this is mouse pad material. Uh, the reason I wanted to share it with you is because it's pretty pricey and I was wondering myself whether I should buy it or not, but I ended up buying one for my wife because she's uh, studying right now. I bought one for myself and I bought one for my son. So I, man, this thing is pricey, but I ended up buying three of them because we love them so much. We were using the ones uh, that you just place on your lap and has a little cushion on the bottom and it might have a little compartment or something, but you know, after a while they started hurting our necks. Me and my wife was having neck problems because we was always staring down at the computer. So I looked for an articulating one that could adjust and, and be higher and lower. And I found this one and I, I just had to swallow that price, man. And here we are. So just right off the top, man, uh, we got this this uh, like leatherette material. It's like a vinyl. It's it's uh, It's got... Uh, no, nah, it doesn't have a cushion. It's just a straight up vinyl. And that can be used as your mouse pad or even writing pad if that's what you're gonna be doing on this thing. Right here, you have this uh, long compartment right here or slit where you can just kind of put your phone or tablet. And speaking of tablet, we do have uh, another device underneath that it comes with. But you can stick your phone or tablet here. If I had it level, it would sit just like that in the compartment. And I like that it's really long so you can put a full size tablet in there like a 12 inch uh, tablet, Mac, or not MacBook, but the the iPad or whatever you got. So that can stay right there. And then if you look here, you know what? Come around here, let's let's put this right there. That way you can see all this stuff, man. All right, so if you look right here at this bottom, you have the, another slit. It's, uh, this one is actually made for this little contraption right here. This actually stops your laptop or your mouse and it can actually just go anywhere you need it to be. Let's say you're using your mouse and your mouse is always sliding and stuff. And you see something got caught right there, man. That's that vinyl. You, something got caught right there and ripped it. So yeah, be careful with your stuff. I, don't, I think my wife probably did this and then swapped it out. Anyways, <laughs> we got this little slit right here. You can put a pencil or something if you want to, or you can use this to stop your laptop uh, from sliding because as you can see, this thing is at a tilt right now. And that's because it has these levers on both sides. And then you can articulate this bad boy to be either flat or you can articulate it to go, uh, what is that, about 45 degrees, I think, maybe a little bit more, but you can articulate it. And that way, when it's on your lap, you don't have to just kind of keep going like that and looking down, and that was my problem. So what I've done is, let's say, let's just move it that way. You can actually lift this. It has these legs, okay? You can actually lift the legs. I don't know what the, the actual dimensions are. That is on the website because that's what I looked at closely when I was purchasing this thing. I was looking at all the dimensions that it could go to. So this is probably like, I don't know, 15 inches tall or something like that. Check the website, man. Link is in the description. It's got these skis on the bottom, man. Look, it's got like ski feet. That way it doesn't catch or it, it barely catches on your sheets or something if you're in the bed or on the couch. You know, it kind of just skis across it like that. So that's cool. But you see how I just press that and lifted it up. That means it can be really high. So if you just come back here, it's really high, right? And then I can articulate it to aim towards me. Uh oh, I didn't lock this. All right, there we go. Now I can articulate it to aim towards me. Come on, wait a minute, what am I doing here? <laughs> oh, there it is, okay. Yeah, I can articulate to aim towards me. And now the laptop or book or papers are facing towards me and I don't have to look down. That is awesome, man. That was a great concept from this company. But that's the end of this part right here in the outer part. Let's go underneath. You see that right there? So we got all kinds of stuff going on under here. So this, all this stuff actually comes with it, which I'm really glad because like I said, the price is no joke. So they're giving you a lot of value here. You slide this out if you want to. You see, I wasn't using it earlier. Slide this out, we'll talk about it in a moment. But right here we have a compartment, okay? This doesn't come off, but it does slide out. Let me just reduce the size of this because it's all up in my face. Put that down like that. 
Okay, are we all the way down? Nope, okay, now we are. So this compartment right here, on the website, it slid out about that far. And I was thinking, man, am I gonna be able to at least put a pencil in there? Where's my phone? All right, my phone will actually fit in there. So you got plenty of depth to go in there, man. I don't know how long that is, but it will fit, you know, your standard pens and pencils and highlighters and stuff like that uh, with no problem. You got plenty of space. This is a Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. So it's a pretty big and wide and, and tall phone and it fits in there with actually more than a thumb space left to go. So if that gives you any kind of reference of how deep that pocket is or how long that pocket is, put all your goodies in there and it kind of just locks. You hear that? So when you put your stuff in there and you pick it up, it's not gonna fall out. Let me demonstrate that real quick because I was kind of worried about that because my, my wife, she'll put all her little goodies in there and then carry this thing around, but it's not gonna fall out. So I like that it locks. So don't forget your phone is actually in there. <laughs> but this thing right here, this is super cool. So this can be a standalone device or it can be an, an attachment. So what it does is as a standalone, you pull these little legs out, right? Set it up like that. Now you got a place where you can put your book, pull this down. You got a place where you can put your book, uh, you know, off to the side. You can use it on the pad if you want to, or you can put it off to the side if you're working at a table if you want to. But you can also flip those legs back in, and then this little part right here slides right into there. So let's kick it off to the side because let's say right now I'm studying. Where's my laptop? I'm studying, and I got my laptop up, and then I got my book right there. All right, now, as you can see, this is probably not my laptop because it's not mine, it's my son's. He's got all these stickers on here because he has turned into a hippie at that college. <laughs> He's got, you know how hippies use all the, all the bumper stickers and stuff, man. Shout out to all my hippie brothers and sisters out there. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, man, so he's got one of these things to take back home for college. My wife has one because she's, you know, currently studying right now. And I have one because I'm a I'm a road warrior, man. I take all my work home and I like to do it while she's uh, doing her work in the bed or on the couch or something like that. And this has been a real joy to have because of the the big surface you got here. You don't have to worry about is my stuff going to fit. You got the extra attachment of the book or tablet shelf because this will fit a, a tablet. You can see how thick that is. It's like bigger than my thumb. So you can fit a book in there if it's opened up and she has done that. And you can fit a 15, 17 inch laptop if you want to. And you, of course you can use it for writing and stuff like that. And the fact that it is fully articulate, man, it keeps your, it saves. This is a neck saver, okay? For those of y'all who are having like upper back and neck issues after studying in bed or sitting on the couch a lot doing some studying and stuff, this right thing, this right here is worth it. Uh, I think we paid a hundred dollars. I think they were $99 for each one of them. That was $300. Now for me and my wife, if we were to go get, uh, I don't know, a massage or a chiropractic visit. I mean, what is that? Two visits at the chiropractor or the massage therapist for the price of one desk. Now we ain't gotta go. <laughs> hey man, I'm no expert in, in, in bones and joints in your neck. I'm no expert in studying or working from home. But what I do know is this thing came in clutch and it was well worth the money that we paid for it. And uh, I, I have absolutely no regrets. So if you were looking at a laptop desk, this is probably gonna be the one for you. Like I said, it's kind of pricey, but to us, it was well worth it, especially when I uh, figured in the price of a massage therapist. <laughs> Either way, man, I gotta go get back to work, man. So that means you got to go, but y'all keep being good to each other and I'll see you when I see you. Whoa, 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 let me get this straight. You sat through this whole video, the whole thing, and never once decided to hit the subscribe button or the like button, man. It'd be the ones closest to you. I'll see how you are. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here?